Hi, I'm Kevin Liu, and on this Tech Corner, we're going to teach you how to balance the pivot gimbal. Today, we're going to be balancing the Panasonic EVA-1 with a Canon 35 lens. All right, the first thing we're going to want to do is install the plate. You're going to want to make sure the arrow is facing the back of the camera, so away from the lens. I'm going to go ahead and screw this on. All right. All right, next, I'm going to go ahead and slide the camera in. The first thing I'm going to do is hold this roll arm and slide the camera in and slowly balance it, pushing it forward and backwards until it doesn't move. Then we'll go ahead and lock it with this one right here. Gonna lock it in place. All right, next we're gonna balance the pitch, which is this axis right here. So first, I'm gonna go ahead and put the camera into this vertical position. I'm gonna slowly let go, and you can see that the camera is leaning towards me. So that means it's too top heavy. You would wanna push this piece down. So I'm just gonna go ahead and release, push it down and then let go again. It's still moving towards me. Slowly adjust it. Okay. And now you can see that since it's moving forward, that means I've over adjusted it and pushed it too far down. I need to push it back up a little bit. Still leaning forward just slightly. All right, just make sure I'm doing micro adjustments. All right, now you can see that it's perfectly still, and it should stay the same regardless of where I put it on this pitch axis. Okay. If you notice that your camera is still too top heavy at the moment, and it still goes towards you after you push it all the way to the end, you can actually use the hex key that's included to adjust this section right here, which will go ahead and give you about an extra two more centimeters to adjust your camera which are good for cameras that are very top heavy, like the Canon 1DX Mark II. But for this particular step, I didn't need it, so I'm just gonna go ahead and push it back up and tighten it back. All right. Next, we're gonna balance the row arm, which is the left and right. So right now, if I let go, it's gonna lean to the left. So I'm gonna want to go ahead and push the camera towards the right side. I've over-adjusted. I'm going to slowly adjusting it back. All right, that looks like it's a good medium. Now if I tilt it to the left and right, it should stay still. All right, that's good balance. Next, we're going to balance the pan, which is this knob right here, it adjusts its forward and back. So I've, the best way to do this is to go ahead and loosen it and tilt the camera forward a little bit. And if you, the arm is moving away from you, you're gonna wanna go ahead and push it in a little bit. It looks like we got a good balance. All right, now that I've balanced the pitch, the roll, and the pan, I can go ahead and turn the gimbal on. All right, you should feel a slight vibration when you turn the gimbal on, and now you should notice that the gimbal is ready to be used. Thanks for watching, and if you wanna learn more about our products, you can visit us at iCanCorp.com.